Good morning everyone. I'm filming off the iPhone so it's a little bit of different quality so I'm sorry about that. But yes, hi, welcome back to the vlog. I'm here at work. Fun stuff. I can't wait till this shift is done and just so I can relax because this shift causes me a lot of stress in my life so I would like to not have that stress. Uh, but anyways, it is, a, it is a beautiful morning. It is a high of 23 out. Oops, sorry. It's a high of 23 out this morning, which is amazing because we haven't had that weather in a long time, especially for it to be 9.30 in the morning and to be so warm. So, yeah. All right, so I'm going to go into work. I will see you guys after it. And, yeah, so toodles. Well, hello, guys. So, today I have not been productive, which is kind of normal on a Monday. I haven't been to the gym in, let's say, two weeks. I feel sad about that, but the reason is because I really like, no, you guys stay there. No, I'm joking. I'm gonna let them out, have a little fun. But he's just sitting out in the sunshine. Hey, Sammy, Sammy, no, halt, Sam. Go, 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 Mr. Magoo. Wow, I was hoping a bit more reaction from you. So right now, did a bit of uh, paperwork stuff like that. Well, not really paperwork. I um, because we used to have four wheelers, but we sold them and don't need them insured anymore because they're not ours. So I had to call the insurance company, get that removed, and basically the money I'm saving is going back into my motorcycle because I'm uh, insuring my motorcycle two ways. That is, if I crash it or do something, or like I drop it or something and it needs to be fixed, then I only have to pay $500 out of the damages. And it's more if I like crash it, like total it or something, like somehow, some reason I fall off the road with it, like it goes into the ditch and it explodes, then I can technically get a new bike. Not a new bike, and same value bike. So. That's why I want that, because my bike's actually worth quite a bit. Well, not quite a bit, but it's it's in really good condition, and I uh, don't want to find myself without another bike in case something happens to it. So that's why I do that, and right now I'm having some bagel. A little bagel with butter. Mmm, butter. But the thing is, I have no idea what I want to eat for supper tonight. That's the big dilemma of the day right now. I have to go to work soon. I'm not ready. I'm not ready for work. Oh, opening the door. Whew. Gonna sit outside for like a little five minutes before I have to go. Sorry, sorry if it's in a weird angle. But yeah, gonna go sit on the swing for a little five minutes and then I'm gonna get ready for work. Um, so far I've got my hygiene bag all ready for when we leave on our trip. Ooh, it's so nice when you walk in the grass and it's not wet. Cause now I can walk with my socks. The only way it's wet is if there's dog pee or something, then that's that's not fun. But, oh, sitting on the chair right now, waiting for work. This is my view right now. The sun is kind of not that great. But tomorrow, I might go just for a little ride on my motorcycle again. Oh, it feels so nice to just actually be free to be able to go whenever I want. Instead of having to wait for someone to see if they're free and then blah, blah, blah. I'm free now, so I'm good. But the thing I can't wait is three weeks from now, we will be in Germany. I can't wait for that. Like, I really can't wait. And then, my goodness, I just can't wait. I really need this, and I'm pretty sure Nicole needs this too. It's gonna be amazing. If, uh, comment below if there's any places that we should visit in Berlin because that's where we we're going uh, for a week and yeah let us know and hopefully we'll we'll have the chance to go visit and obviously we are gonna film this stuff we are going to do all that and I'm gonna try and bring my GoPro because it'd be pretty cool I rent a little like bike not a motorcycle but like a pedal bike and I can attach it to it that'd be freaking awesome yeah I'm gonna try, I'm gonna bring all my equipment and stuff for that. Oh, I can't wait. And I'm back from work. Yeah, I don't know if David filmed today. It looks like he did, because the camera's been moved. 
But yes, I'm all done from work. I spent some time at my mama's and then now I'm back to chill and actually write my bridesmaid speech, or my maid of honor speech. Yeah, gotta get on that. But I've been doing some other things today. And just, yeah, it's been a pretty chill day. It was a beautiful day out today, but it's supposed to thunder shower, but that's okay. Cause it, was, it made it for today. Today was really, really nice, which I'm really happy about. Do you smell something, Sam? He's making weird faces. But yes, I'm gonna make myself some supper. Although I don't know what I'm gonna have for supper, but I'm gonna make myself some supper. So for supper tonight, I am making a soup. And I've cut up some sweet potatoes and baking them, as well as I have been really lacking in my fruit lately, so I had about eight mangoes, mini mangoes, and I've cut it all up and shoved it all into there, and I'm gonna eat that as much as I can. Probably the whole thing, but as much as I can. <sighs> so I can be healthy, yeah. Because mangoes are good for you people. And there's, these ones are so sweet and delicious, so can't wait to eat them. I already started eating them when I was cutting them. I am so full, I ate so much. <laughs> I'm never gonna even eat these or even touch them tonight, I'm so full. After having the soup, I'm just like, I think I'm like gonna go into a food coma because I'm so full and it actually is really painful to stand up. That's how full I am. I ate so much. <laughs> so I have my big luggage out. I am packing way in advance because I'm gonna be crazy busy before the, um, before we leave, so I want to get stuff starting, I want to start packing stuff so that I can get stuff out of the way because I don't want to be packing last minute. I did it last time I went to Europe and it was not fun because I had a final exam and I left the next day. Bad idea. So I am trying to get things packed. I got most of our hy hygiene stuff packed. David is just, I don't know what's happening with him, but I'm going to start Maybe putting a couple little things in the luggage just to get it out of the way, kind of, and just to, you know, kind of get things going. I started with my carry on, but I think I'm gonna bring this as my purse and get another book bag as my carry on. Not really sure because this isn't really big. But yeah, I'm just trying to get this all out of the way right now so the next couple weeks are less crazy and less hectic for me and it will just help. So. Yes, trying to get everything organized. Plus, I'm trying to organize a couple things for the wedding, so we're good. Please ignore my messy hair and my heavy breathing. I'm like, haven't even cooled down from my warm up, or from my warm up. Well, it technically was a warm up. Uh, I started to work out, as you can see, I'm sweaty, like high cardio workout, and I like stopped in between sets, and like I stepped down, and then I turned, but I didn't move my leg and my knee just cracked and it's seriously killing me so bad right now. So I'm gonna try and put some ice on it, but I'm gonna start doing arms to try and counteract to do finish my workout because I didn't do much of a workout yet. I've only done a couple things, so I'm gonna put some ice on it and still work out. So that means no excuses. Even though you get hurt, you can do your arms, right? So for my post-workout snack, I'm having these raw brownies, which have an insane amount of protein. And I'm having a banana. And that's it. A little snack just after to get my workout done and complete. And yes, I'm so dead right now, guys. I am freaking dead. Alright, guys. I'm done for the day. I'm completely wiped out. I'm ready for bed. So I will see you guys tomorrow. Thanks so much for watching and coming along with us today. So I will see you guys later. Bye!